it is the traveling Viking back again and today we're coming to you from the beautiful town of Kutsaisi here in Georgia in central Georgia located on the Rioni River today we're gonna go on a mini bus that I'm waiting for just parked around the corner here to a town a little village called Skaltubo or something like that this town is where Joseph Stalin and all the USSR Soviet Union uh, leaders and elites had their big spa day out this was where they had their spa holidays today after the fall of the Soviet Union in this town all these beautiful old Soviet sanatoriums are left abandoned so that's what we're gonna go explore and then we're gonna come back and explore the town here of Kutsaisi Kutsaisi is the third biggest city here in Georgia we're gonna come back explore this city in the afternoon they're doing practice for some kind of show what are you practicing for practice this is Georgian dance Georgian and Tra traditional oh. Georgian dance traditional, yeah. okay no, sit here. Uh, practice yes, yes. okay I can sit oh. over there all right hello my friend how are you, are you? thank you where are you from? Uh, Denmark. Oh, very good, very nice. I am from Georgia, my friend. Georgia. Yes. Traditional Georgian dance. Good, good, very good. <laughs> Hello. Professor. How are you? How are you? Teacher. Teacher? I teacher. Oh, okay. I'm sub teacher. You're director? Yes. Uh -huh. Ah, okay, okay. Oh, okay. Side, Check it out. We've got the band here. Yeah. Yeah. And the Georgian flag up there. German? Uh, Denmark. Huh? Denmark. Alright, check out the view from up here. You can imagine how Stalin would have sat here on his holidays, on his spa holidays back in the day. Also watching Georgian traditional dances if they let them perform local dances back then or if they would do Soviet patriot shows I cannot I cannot tell but you could definitely imagine the greatness of this little theater here back in the day in the Soviet times that is wonderful a walk through the history the majestic history of this old theater here man how do you dance like that on your feet on your toes how do you dance like that on your toes like this yes Ma many years of practice yeah how many years have you been practicing 15 16 years old 15 years since you were a little kid okay it's basically like similar to ballet when i start dance 
I was six years old. Five. Five. Okay. It's like ballet, pretty much. No, Sim similar to ballet. Ballet is hard. Ballet. It's hard. It's more. It's more difficult than than ballet. It's very impressive. Thank you. I imagine when you do the full show, you will be like in some. In December, we have a concert here. Yeah. In December? Yeah. Okay. And you'll be in classical oh, dress? Yeah. Now you're just wearing the pants. Yeah. Okay. What's your name? My name is Saba. What? Saba. Saba. Yeah. I'm Sebastian. Thank you for the, for the little show. I'll keep exploring the town. Thank you. Thank you. I will keep exploring. Super, very nice. Yeah, nice. Thank you. I will go explore the town. Very good, my friends. Thank you. Thank you. Check it out. There's mattresses and shopping bags up there. Light sun in there as well. Looks like some people are squatting there. They're living in here. They've got firewood and everything. So there must be some people living inside these buildings here. You can see on the entrance here as well, there are some flowers. There's some flowers, there's tables and bench with a little tablecloth on it. There's a Georgian flag. So some, some people still live in these buildings these days today I've read about online believe it or not I do do some research check this out what a beautiful old abandoned building we have here one main entrance here and a second grand entrance with a beautiful old derelict staircase and a what must have been a fountain this would have been the parking spot obviously out here the parking the parking lot wow wow the old classic marble soviet pillars doorway arches grand staircases oh my god check that out that looks eerie as it looks today wow and the, uh, the other way here and let's go the main attraction the grand Woo! listen to that the grand ballet staircase i'm standing right in the middle of the room here and the echo is insane wow check that out you can imagine starling just coming walking down this staircase here walking through what would probably have been the reception in this area out to a balcony over here oh my days i give you stalin's favorite spa retreat what look at this old traditional suitcase here wow and a bed with some old used clothes on it what do we have in here not really anything oh yeah check it out <laughs> old tv like this look at that oh my god Old school Ferraris or something. Stickers on here. Oh, hello there. This is amazing. Check out this. Where probably would have been the ballroom, the party room. And check out the view. Been accompanied by a little cow. The view out to what would have been, as I said, the car park. And the pool down there maybe the pool i don't know or maybe just a fountain apparently this used to be or this town here the area here skaltubo 
the water that is in the rivers and the, the waterways here um, supposedly full of of beautiful minerals that will basically treat and heal your body um, and this was why Soviet the Soviet Union the elite of the Soviet Union would come here for holidays back in the day back in the Soviet Union times I imagine it would only really be the elite that come that would come uh, come to this part look here again flowers on the all the way around here of the old door such beautiful detail so yeah basically it's said to be healing powers in the water here in this um, here in this region and therefore this would be Stalin's favorite retreat to come here on a spa holiday with his missus or mistresses yeah basically enjoy a beautiful spa holiday spa retreat old books here as well Georgian writing maybe this was how it looked back in the day old Soviet propaganda yeah check this out absolutely trash another man if you could restore these suitcases they would be phenomenal and yeah, just trashed here with old clothing. Family, no, probably these are cutouts from magazines, not family photos. Like this over here, have some family photos. Wow. Imagine coming here to live. That's crazy. What do we say over here? Oh, Christmas advertising. 2007 so again not too old over there around the corner there's a guy living here he doesn't want to be on he doesn't want to want me to come to be on, on camera or anything but if I turn it down here you can see there's a lights on down there so he's got himself a little apartment where he's living Right down there, as you can see, there's lights on. Someone is living here, but as I say, he doesn't want to be filmed. You can imagine that maybe he's from that region that I was talking about when we were walking in, or maybe he's an illegal immigrant or something. He doesn't want to be on. He doesn't want me to come and talk to him. I just said hello from from the balcony over here. So yeah, there are still people living or squatting in this in these abandoned buildings <laughs> can i try one of these one let's see we try this one meats inside meats nothing meat what's inside Something inside, yeah? <laughs> we try. Dania. 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 Da, juice, juice. juice. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Da. Da. Can I try one of these as well? I try one? One, one. Okay. Which one is best? This one or this one? The same. Okay. So let's try this bread thing and our juice or whatever this is. Let's start with the juice. Mm. Okay, I see, I see. It's like what do you call these? Soda stream. It's basically a homemade soda. So, like sparkling water with some kind of juice. Now, let's try this bread thing. There's something inside. Let's see. It looks like it's meat or something. Let's try some kind of paste. All right. 
very basic, but it will keep me going for sure. And then we can explore this market here. Let's see what else we can find. I think this is also Hachapuri. I'm not sure, but uh, it's good. It's simple. It will keep me going. It will keep me powering through so we can explore this little market here as well before we head to the central market after. You sell this? No, man. Uh, 44. Tuala. Four, four. Tuala. Two lari. Okay. Can I take one? One pair? Yes. 44. Okay. Hello. Okay. This is 44. Okay. Okay. You have stronger? Like a leather. Like yes. this? Like this? This? Like this? What are called? Uh, five lari. Okay, yeah, I think this is better. Two. Okay. And this one, five. Size 44. Looks. 44, yeah? This shoe. 44. Okay. Five lari, yeah? Okay. Hello. You want to try? <laughs> Be cameraman. Okay. Where are you from? Mm. Kutaisi. Raja. Raja. Oh. Like this. There we go. Uh, just, just this one. Not this one. Only this. Yes, yes. This one. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. What is your name? Oga. Oga. Okay. Nice to meet you. You sell this? Yes, un pros. Ah, for garden. Tato, tato. For trees. Cut trees. This one. Okay. I don't need that. <laughs> they won't let me take that in the airplane. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Goodbye. Goodbye. What is this one? Chacha. 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 What is uh, that? Maybe Thank now we say the uh, very similar. Yeah. Home maybe, brew. Maybe um, you testing strong Try. alcohol. No. Like a vodka or something. You test. Okay. Okay. Apricot. Mmm. It's good. I see. This is like a home you? brew. Strong. Sure. Yeah. But uh, smell it's good. Smell is like apricot, yes. yeah. <laughs> True. Yes. This is like uh, basically like homebrew schnapps. Yeah. Like schnapps oh, in, yes. Yes. In, in my country. Yes. Yes. Denmark. You? You're an English teacher in Kutaisi. Ah. ah. Thank you for the whole video. <laughs> Fantastic. Because it's a, uh, Fantastic. video from German. Denmark. Denmark. German. Yes. After Denmark. It will be in UK. How do you like? Interesting. My first time trying this. Kutaisi? Kutaisi is good. Good. I went to Skaltubo today. How does people today here, how do people today think about the Soviet Union and Russia? It's better to live, but it's our dream. You like the Soviet Union? It was better? Better. Back then? But people in our better. Now? Now. Nowadays yeah. it's better? Warm and... Uh-huh. So now it's better than the Soviet Union time? Yeah. I am strong. So you don't... Do you like drinking? Yes. My father, my father imports wine. So I like wine. What was the name of this? Kacha? Chacha? Chacha. Yes, yes. Chacha. Yes. Okay. This one. Cheese. Cheese. Cheese is very good too. Chacha. Chacha. So you don't. People don't like Stalin and no. and this anymore. Old people like. Old people. What do we have here? This seems like a Georgian whiskey or something, or maybe cognac. <laughs> I think we need to try something of this. We've got new customers again. Seems like I'm bringing luck. 
And here we have his name. Akaki Gurguciani. In Facebook you can find this guy. He has a little page where you can buy his wine. <laughs> this one is cognac? Cognac. Ah. Many people coming. Do you like this? Like this? Like yeah. this? I don't know. And uh, coming then, how much? And uh, what do you have? Yeah. I have a granite grapes. I, I ask it. Ask it me. And uh -huh. I have uh, questions. Everything. Yes. Uh, green, no, green, uh, it's possible to try? Like cognac? Yes. Maybe test it. It's, po it's possible to test? Yes. The cognac? No, yeah. Yeah. And how much for the cognac? Also five? Yes. Everything is five? Five because uh, I, I don't want uh, many uh, prices. Okay. Only, only low price, no normal price. And everything is made by your friends? Yeah. Yeah, in your village? Yes. Not Kutsaisi, another little village no, outside of Kutsaisi? Uh, local. Not everything local, but after, okay. after 18 kilometers. Near Kutsaisi. Okay, okay. Ooh. Oh yeah, that's better than the cha cha. Yes, better. Yes, that's more my style. <laughs> less schnapps, less vodka, more this. Yes. I think we're gonna have to take one of these. You want this one? Yeah. Good. Gonna have to buy one of those. Oh my god, that's nice. <laughs> now we just need a cigar. <laughs> Some cognac and cigar. Yes. Okay, time to buy. I will take one of the cognac and one of the wine. Really? Yes. Half or one liter? One liter wine, half liter cognac. It's good. Yes. And uh, uh, semi sweet wine or white wine or. Dry red. Dry red? Yes. This one. Is... This one here. Maybe you can take this camera and uh -huh. you. Yes. Let's try that. I can pour for sure. You just show me what to do. Okay. Slowly, slowly. Okay, let's try. There we go. Like a pro. Look at that. What a beautiful pour. So this one is 10, yeah? 10 lari is this one, yeah? Okay. Opa, there we go like this okay that was a little bit full okay there we go freshly poured white red wine and now we need the cognac what do you think of my pour there cognac cognac okay so people can just come here with a bottle as well and buy like that yeah yes People can just come here with like a bottle and say, I want two liters of this or whatever. Okay, okay. Beautiful. And uh, take this one? Yes. The same one. Okay. There we go. Look at that. A stunning pool. Now that's how you do it. <laughs> You're professional. Yes. I need training. Yes. There we go. Look, you didn't spill a drop. I spilled. No problem. <laughs> You're professional. No problem. No problem. Okay. Yes. And then we need to try one of these as well. I don't know which one is the best one. What's your favorite? Maybe traditional. Traditional. First time, okay. First time. Okay. First time. Yeah. One of those, and then we try the the wine and the cognac. Like this, no? Ten and five. Ten and five and two. Seventeen. Ah, you keep. Boss. Give me hand. Give me hands. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you very much. Thank you too. Nice to meet someone who speaks English. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we've made it into the heart of this little hood here, but I gotta say, other than other than just being these old commie blocks, these old communist constructions of apartment blocks here, 
all gray. There isn't much hood feeling to it. Like the cars look decent. There's lots of little shops around. Seems pretty chill to be honest. Very different from the favelas <laughs> or the hoods of South America in general. Just a couple guys sitting here. Hello. Hello, hello, my friend. <laughs> Mechanic. You? Yeah. Fixing cars. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Badolesha. <laughs> How are you? <laughs> Denmark. 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 What? Streams uh, YouTube you travel. Uh -huh. What? What? You are in life? No, no. We're publishing a couple of weeks video. Uh, you just make a record, yeah? Making travel video. <laughs> I got that. Checking out what this area is like. You speak English? Yeah. A little bit. Nice. Not many people here speak English. Yeah. <laughs> How do you learn? Uh, I use master years in Germany. In Germany? Ah, whereabouts? In Stuttgart. Stuttgart, ah. Do you like Paratskelia? Yeah, of hey, course. Paratskelia, my best friend. So. Your best friend? Yeah. What city is he from? Uh, he from from where he is, <laughs> is he from here? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's from this area? Yeah. This neighborhood here? Okay, cool. Smoking marijuana? Not really. <laughs> <laughs> Not really my thing. Why not? And you drink? I drink, of course. What do you drink? Uh, here in Georgia we drink wine, no? Of course. Yeah. yeah. Because this is wine country, you know? The home country of wine. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Oh, these letters are completely different. Baba. Check it out. <laughs> this is Georgian letters. English. Yeah, is this English? Yes, yes. Russian. Ah, it's Russian. Russian. You speak Russian Russia here? Russia is occupied. Russia is occupying. Putin can do. All Georgian men fuck Putin's mother. Ah. ah yes. We don't like Putin here, no. I see a lot of uh, Ukraine flags around. I subscribe. Because my country 25% takes Russia. Yeah. With war and like this. Oh, okay. And we have too many years war with Russia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> because this very big history. Mm -hmm. Russia said we help you, and we fight together in other countries. Yeah. And next, so uh, uh, when we need help from mm -hmm. Russia, just he, uh, he don't come. Leave you alone. Yeah. Yeah. And this don't happen uh, one time. No, this no. This happened too many times. Because Russia has control over two areas here in yeah. Russia, in uh, Georgia as well, right? Yeah, yeah. Abkhazia, Abkhazia. and South Ossetia, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Abkhazia occupied by Russia. Occupied by Russia. Russia. It's like... Uh, Russia. Like Ukraine. Abkhazia is Georgia. Bro. Yes, yes, exactly. We are first European, you know? Do you consider Georgia Europe or Asia? Do you think of yourself as Asian or European? Um, half is Europe and half, half is Asia. Uh, half Asia? Yeah, uh, here Asia, here Europe, and we are here. In the middle? Yeah. Because the letters are different yeah. and language is very different from European yeah. languages. And Thank you very much. Thank you. Nice to find someone who speaks a bit of English. <laughs> okay, this is no problem. Have if a good day. something, yeah? I work here yeah. and you can just come, ask me and mm -hmm. I will help you. Or if you have issues with your cars traveling in Georgia, come here. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, Andri? Yeah. We'll fix it for you. Yeah. Okay, thank you. No problem. Have a good day. You I'll too. keep exploring. Bye. Bye. So we've stumbled upon a market here. Food and... And veg, and hopefully, I'm hoping that I can find a Georgia shirt with a Quartzkelia somewhere here. But this section of the market seems to be all food. Check it out, fish and everything here. Hello. Where I find a Georgia t-shirt. Georgia football. Uh, football shirt. With the Quartzkelia. Football shirt. <laughs> I'm looking for a football shirt. Can I find here in the market? Over there, over here? A uh, football shirt. This way. Okay, thank you. So you're saying head? Ah, this way. Over here. See, all we have for sale is food and veg. Hello. 
All we have for sale here is, is food, fish, vegetables. That's not really what I'm looking for. I'm looking for the Kvartskelia shirt. <laughs> one, 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 three beer. Ah, right, here we go. How much one beer? Uh huh. Video. <laughs> how much one? One? How much? Check it out. Homemade. You make your production? Yes. Ah. And you can buy like whole bottle like this over there. Twenty two point five. Two point five. So one dollar. Cheers. Pregaya. Pregaya. Prekaya. Pre Pre okay. Prekaya. Prekaya. In my language, skol. 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 Padakachi katakaka. What is your name? Oh. English. Uh, Dania. 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 Nazim. Nasim. Ataka. Murat Khan. What? Murat Khan. Murat Khan. Okay. Me is Sebastian. Me is Sebastian. 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 Yes. Nice yes. to meet you. Yes. Georgian beer? Open. <laughs> Homemade beer. Okay. <laughs> so your name was? Name? Uh, name? Name. Nahim. Nahim. And you? Nazim. Nazim. Okay. Nathan. Nazim. Arabic name? Uh, no. 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 Nazim is like Arabic. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. Okay, okay. How was it in Georgian? Murat Khana. Murat Khana. Murat Khana. Murat Khana. Pasayev. Pasayev. Okay. Murat Khana Pasayev. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. You working here? No. Work? Work. Okay. Work. Me work here. Angeles. Uh, Dania. Dan Dania. 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 Dania Mark. Dania Mark. Yes. yes. Oh, Dania Mark. Huh? That's good. Um, yes. Me, tourist. Tourist. Travel, Georgia. Georgia, Turkey. Turkey. Turkey, Georgia. Turkey, one trip. No, Turkey, 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 Yes. One trip, Georgia. One trip, uh, Turkey. <laughs> <laughs> You're trying the YouTube game. Yes. yes. Ah, okay. Okay. Nazim. 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 Skol. Nazim. Goal. 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 Nazim. Goal. Nazim. Goal. Skol. 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 So he's trying the YouTube game here as well. Yes, <laughs> Ah, you have a little camera here. No. Look. Look at this one. Camera. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got a little camera over here on your phone. What's your work? What you work, Murat Khano. <laughs> what do you work with? Murat. Murat. Murat Pasayev. What is Murat? Yeah. Murat Pasayev. Like transport. Transport. Okay. 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 Cheers. Cheers. What's this? So this is what they work with. They sell some vegetables, I think. <laughs> they have no idea what I'm saying, and I have no idea really what I'm saying. What they what they're saying to me. Oh my god, so yeah, we can stand here, get a little beer. She's home producing. <laughs> Those guys were just having a little break between selling there. I think it was eggplant that I was in there. So just walking around on the shoulder selling their eggplants. So I'm, by chance, we're listening. Ah. Your conversation with this. Mm -hmm. Guys, so I want to say is that they weren't Georgians. Do you understand? They were not Georgian. No. No, I did not understand that. Yes. Uh, one of them was uh, Kurt, Kurt. Kurdish. Kurt. Kurdish. Oh, okay. They From uh... Turkey, and one of them was uh, Azerbaijanian. Ah. So none of them was Georgian. Because of this, I wanted to. <laughs> okay. To say to you that they were Georgian. You're from Georgia. I'm Georgian. Oh, okay. <laughs> nice. So, do you live in this area? 
No. Oh, you live in another part of the city? Uh, yes, I live in Sabutolo, and there's a center, but there we came to buy something that you can buy only in this market. What? My husband buys something for hunting. Hunting? Oh, yes. okay. Hunter in the mountains uh, here in yes, Georgia. Yes, so oh. This is like a big market where you can basically find everything. Uh, yes, but uncomfortable. Uncomfortable. To buy something here, so we go in big supermarkets, Carrefour, like you know. Okay, yeah, yeah. So this is not just for uh, uh, people who have no much money. Oh, okay. You understand? This is like the hood of Tbilisi. Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> I have a question. I'm interested. From here. Uh, how can get there? What? Uh, what's the reason that you came here? It's not touristic no. destination. No. So That's this. exactly why. Ah, so. I wanted to see what to is see real life. What is yes. real life in yes. Georgia? It's a very good idea. Our population is very different. They are from other nationalities. Mm -hmm. Culture, really. Yeah. Religion. Culture is different here compared to Turkey. Yes. People are more serious here. Like, with the look on Maybe, the face yes they look yes. like mm, always a little bit angry they look like <laughs> but then you start talking to them and they seem ah. nice but when you first look you're like oh. angry you're not angry <laughs> sometimes so I th I'll think about this yeah yeah it is not correct yet that I am speaking about this point but subject but I, it, I felt something pity that you thought that they were Georgians. Ah, okay. <laughs> I thought they were. Uh -huh. So one from Azerbaijan and one from Turkey. Uh, Turkey. Or Kurdish. Oh, Kurdish. But they live uh, here. They live here. They live here. Yeah. Yes. Work here. Work here, live here. I see, I see. Mm -hmm. as, uh, as you mentioned, this people darker, darker. Uh -huh. They are not Georgians. They are the Virginians, mm -hmm. Armenians, okay. and look darker. Appearance. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, Georgians aren't so dark no. people. So, and they uh, work uh, such kind of professions. They sell fruits and vegetables. Yes, they, and, uh, what? and what's life like in Georgia now? It is not diff um, uh, easy. Not easy? Not easy. Okay. Because uh, it's, we have no money. Money. No, We're but there's lots money. of yes. lots of new buildings yes. getting built. It's very interesting. It is uh, even here, like over there. There's one building getting yes. built. You can see more and more beautiful and uh, expensive buildings and mm -hmm. places and everything. But you see, uh, our mentality, tradition, mentality, yeah. mentality, mentality, mentality. Yes, see? yes. So we want to do everything and to buy everything good expensive so we do we try our best to do I this i see ah yes i see but it is not easy to do but in spite of this we give to our children good education because it it seems like the economy is going yes yes but better uh, here. Be, yes better but uh, better than see, when it was soviet union yes of course yes uh, but uh, it's uh, not easy to find a good job. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh, to earn money, it's a financial crisis in uh, yeah. around the world. So yeah, right now finance is not good anywhere in the world. Anywhere, really. yes. <laughs> uh, yes. But like some of the cars here, there was just one passing by there, it is right hand driven. I don't know what is going on with that. So if you're from here in Georgia and you know the ex the explanation right behind that because those cars are also on Georgian number plates it's not like they're coming in from some of the neighboring countries um, and therefore will be right hand driven they are on Georgian number plates so I don't know what's going on it will be certainly <laughs> seems quite difficult to drive a right hand like this one right here is right hand driven let's ask him if he knows why are some cars right-hand driven here? Because I think it's from Japan and it's cost lower than uh, right, right hand. Okay, left-hand driven. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you drive on the right-hand side? It's very bad. <laughs> Is very it not bad. difficult? Yeah, it's very difficult. And it's 
making a lot of, uh, how to say, avaria. Accidents or what? Accidents, yeah. Accidents, oh, okay. So people buy this car, like this one, straight because from Japan? Of course, lower. So it's cheaper? Yeah. Cheaper. Okay, okay. Well, thank you very much for that. I was wondering. <laughs> thank you. Bye. Have a good day. There you go. So it's simply because they are cheaper. Because as you see, it is on Georgian number plates. And this guy was Georgian. <laughs> but there's the explanation. Imagine that. As he's saying, living uh, or driving there, right hand, uh, right hand driven cars on a, on a right hand driven uh, driving roads. You're sitting on the inside. You can't see on the, uh, on the outside. Like, that is mental to me. Imagine that. That's why you get a lot of accidents, apparently. So there you go. They drive on the right hand. They drive right hand driven cars, even though they drive on the right hand side of the road. And here we go. The river running through all of Tbilisi. Beautiful, beautiful views. Check it out. Over what seems to be more of the rich area over here. Some beautiful church over there. Georgia is one of the oldest Christian countries in the whole world. Yeah, wonderful view. As you can see, we have a, a Sheraton fancy hotel over here. So we're coming in into the fancy part of the center now. And I think that's also marking, going to be the marker of the end of this video here. Because yeah, we're coming out of, out of the interesting area, out of the hold of Tbilisi and market area, busy area into this area here with fancy apartment buildings and beautiful hotels and so on that's just like anywhere else in the world so with that said I think we will call it an end for the video here and I will see you tomorrow by the way we were unsuccessful in hunting for that shirt the football shirt that I wanted or maybe a rugby shirt as well so we will go Check the view over here, over the over the uh, the river, and with the view of the river, we will end the video for today, and then we'll see you when I see you. Check it out.